of candle lights lit up the Beaumont Event Center. Dozens of Southeast Texans joined together to honor the victims of a mass shooting in Colorado Springs. Five people were gunned down at an LGBTQ club over the weekend. Ashley Paul, Daniel Aston, Raymond Green Vance, Derek Rump and Kelly Loving all taken too soon in a senseless act of violence. Organizers only put the invite out yesterday and still a crowd gathered in a show of solidarity. As 12 News reporter Cameron Syberty explains tonight in their shared grief, they hope to create change. A somber scene out here tonight at the Beaumont Event Center as dozens of Southeast Texans came out to honor the victims of the Colorado Springs shooting. Those I spoke to say it's time for change. Silence overtaking the Beaumont Event Center Tuesday night. It's support. It's a community. We have to stand together because nobody else will. More than a thousand miles away, Southeast Texans sharing the pain being felt in Colorado Springs. Anger, resentment, um, bitterness, obviously, sadness. Um, it, it's just senseless. As they bowed their heads, they took turns. Kelly loving saying the names of the victims gunned down at an LGBTQ club over the weekend bamboozles me. I just don't I don't get it. What is so wrong with just simply letting people live, be themselves, love who they want to love brings back bad memories from six years ago from the pulse and it's lucky it wasn't as bad among the crowd. Sheriff Zena Stevens. It hurts. It's senseless trying to wrap our heads around why it keeps it happening and we as a society can't figure out how to stop it. She says she's tired of the violence. Hate is nonpartisan. Hurting people is nonpartisan. I'm tired that we have to keep having these interviews and these discussions. It's really, really old, you know. Um, we're all human beings, you know, and so it's, it's very simple. Again, it's not about politics, it's about people, it's about life. The candles burned out, but hope still alive. There's still hate in the world, but I have to believe that love wins. I, I can't I can't go on without having something to hope for. And if you don't have hope, then hate wins. It was also said tonight that a bouquet of flowers was sent to the memorial in Colorado Springs. It's addressed from Beaumont, Texas. Reporting at the event center, Cameron Seibert, 12 News. All right, Cam, another chilly night.